Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life, and this is part two. This is the AT&T testing. So here we go. As you can see right off the back, AT&T only has two bars in this area. Verizon had four. So we're going to see how AT&T performs. All right, so right off the back, it looks like AT&T does look to perform better in this area, even with a lot of people here. So on the download, we got 21.1. And on the upload, we are at 19.5. So that's really good to see. AT&T does look to perform a bit better in this area. Let's see if it's consistent. Alrighty, so right around the same speed as the first test. So it does look to be consistent. Do a few more. All right, so far, all the tests seem to be consistent on download and upload as well. So that's really good to see. AT&T does look to perform better in this area. And there's a few areas that I've already seen AT&T perform better than Verizon. So on this one at 15.3 and the upload seems to be steady at around 20. So I'm going to do one more test and then I'm going to do some more testing on Verizon versus AT&T here in the next few days. So stay tuned for that. It's kind of strange that Verizon overall is better, but AT&T does seem to perform better in a lot of areas. So I'm going to definitely have to do a lot more testing in the next few days. Alrighty, so it, speeds do seem consistent in this area. There wasn't really a big drop off. So that's definitely good to see. So let me know in the comment section down below. These first few tests that I've done with Verizon and AT&T, it does look like AT&T performs better in a lot of areas. So definitely stay tuned. I have some more testing coming. Give these videos a thumbs up. It keeps me motivated. keeps me going. Like, share, subscribe. This is Tyrone with Tech Life, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.